All right, hello and welcome to this quick lightning talk about Wikidata for li libraries and librarians in Nigeria. Um, just to go over some real basic logistics, you've probably seen this before. Um, there is a code of conduct, please be cool. Um, any other information you need will be on the, on the conference website. And because we don't have a lot of time, I will just turn it over to Winnie to, to do the presentation or to do the introduction. Uh, yes, uh, good evening, good afternoon, everyone. We welcome you to the 2022 uh, Linked Data Conference. Uh, today's, today's speaker is uh, Bukola James. Uh, she's a student with the Kwara State University, Malete, Nigeria. Um, she's currently a virtual intern for the IFLA Bislis. Uh, she's also a Wikimedian volunteer and also a project leader for different projects that promote the application of Wikipedia products and projects in the GLAM institutions uh, by different professionals in Nigeria. She's also a certified trainer of the Reading Wikipedia in the classroom program. She's also the media publicity, the National Association of Library Information Science Students in Nigeria, and has taken part in different library advocacy programs in Nigeria. Please welcome me today. Uh, Ms. Jim, Ms. James uh, Bukola will be sharing us a brief a lighting talk. You must welcome James. Thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Moeni. I really appreciate uh, the time. And so uh, just a quick one, because I know it's a lightning talk and I wouldn't want to waste more time. So this um, uh, a lightning talk focuses on my um, my project experience about Wikidata for libraries and librarians in Nigeria. And um, the next slide, please. Okay, uh, so about me, my name is Bukola Ulitola James, like they said, I joined Wikipedia in 2020 and I'm Wikipedia in African Libraries, a certified trainer of the Reading Wikipedia in the classroom. And I primarily contribute to uh, Wikipedia, Wikidata, and Wikicommon. Next slide. So the background of this project, um, a, this project was as a result of a query that I ran on Wikidata query service. Uh, to get information that is um, raw data about libraries and notable librarians in Nigeria. And uh, the query I ran uh, last year, around um, September to be precise, I discovered that uh, only 14 results, only 14 librarians were existing on uh, Wikidata. And out of so many libraries that we have, in over um, 36 states in Nigeria, the query brought back only 46 libraries. So, and these 46 libraries cover both uh, school library, public library, academic library, private library, and the likes. And I discovered that this um, query was not uh, what was expected because considering the vast uh, diversity of people in Nigeria, and over uh, uh, millions of population that we have in Nigeria. And we are having just 46 libraries on Wikidata. So that was what um, made me embark on this project. And again, I discovered that there was lack of widespread adoption and availability of data, especially as it relates to libraries and notable librarians in Nigeria. So and uh, this was also why I had to um, come up with this project. Again, there, there was presence of incomplete data about some data that were existing on Wikidata for libraries and librarians. Like say, for example, some of the statements were not complete. Uh, for some, it was just the label that was created. So we needed to work on this project. And that was what begs the Wikidata for libraries and librarians. Next slide. 
So our project goal was one, to recruit new editors and increase skills for existing editors. So we wanted to re recruit um, um, 30 new editors for this project and also increase skills for existing editors. We also wanted to create and improve items on libraries and notable librarians in Nigeria on Wikidata. Next slide. Okay, uh, so uh, our action points, the uh, things we wanted to do, the strategy that we use to achieve this uh, campaign was one, to create awareness for this project on social media. So we created awareness across uh, different social media platform, uh, WhatsApp, Facebook, Twitter, and the likes. And uh, to teach participants how to access and create a Wikidata account because we discovered that most of them that wanted to participate, they were not having existing Wikidata accounts. So we had to guide them on how to create accounts. We also want to teach the participant the general editing rule of Wikidata, because for some of them, they are very familiar with the editing rule for uh, Wikipedia. So we had to also expose them to some of the uh, necessities, the principle for editing Wikidata. So, and uh, we wanted to create and improve 200 plus items for libraries and librarians in Nigeria. So this was our target before the uh, commencement of the project. Next slide. So um, this, uh, our target, like I said, was to create 200 plus items. And again, we wanted to hold two physical events which uh, which uh, was possible because we had already created like a form of publicity and created awareness among different LIA schools within Kwara State. We also uh, reached out to the uh, Nigerian Library Association through the chairman here in Kwara, in Kwara State. And we, through some WhatsApp platform, we reached out to um, some, we reached out to LIA students so that they can also be part of this. So the event, the physical event was to host 30 participants. And then uh, we wanted to recruit 10 new editors, then 200 uh, items to improve or create. Then our outcome, as you can see on the dashboard, uh, I don't know if we can zoom it. You would discover that at the end of the project, we were able to recruit 55 new editors. And then uh, instead of um, the 200 items that we add uh, as a target, at the end of this project, we were able to create 471 items and we edited 819 items and added 926 references to uh, libraries and librarians items that were created on Wikidata. So uh, the dashboard, we um, 101, Nigerian librarians uh, were 101 Nigerian librarians were uh, create like we created items of 101 li Nigerian librarians that were notable and this uh, notability was also um, uh, was also uh, decided based on the existing nominal list of librarians in Nigeria. Uh, because we had to reach out to the National Library of Nigeria to get the nominal list of registered librarians in Nigeria. And again, we also got uh, the list of existing uh, registered library school that were recognized from the National Library of Nigeria. So this was what really helped the project to um, uh, be very impactful and um, a lot, a, a lot easy for editors that wanted to be part of the project. Next slide. Okay, uh, so some of the challenges that we faced was that um, new editors needed one-on-one -on -one support during the training. So um, instead of the two physical events that we had in mind, uh, at the end of the day, we had to still do like online training because our 
the target for the physical events was for 30 participants. And uh, at the end, we had um, over 55 new editors and we needed to also uh, create a, a space for these people to accommodate them and train them. So this was like a challenge to us. We had to go out of the way and um, um, create like an online Zoom training for these participants to join the, uh, uh, the campaign. So we had more participants than we expected and then our budget. And this really affected our budget because we budgeted for 30 uh, participants, both for the physical events and um, for those that will be on the event dashboard. So it was a problem, but uh, we had to cut down our budget and also make use of the miscellaneous that was available for this project. So we had to provide series of online trainings for those who could not, who, who we could not accommodate physically at those uh, uh, physical events. So this is um, all about my experience for this project. And I believe that um, with this, they are, we have succeeded in improving uh, Wikidata items for libraries and librarians in Nigeria. Although they still, there are still uh, a, a need for us to work on improving, uh, on creating more Wikidata items for libraries and librarians. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much, uh, James, for that uh, presentation, very insightful and also sharing your experience with us. I know Nigeria has a, a very strong movement for the weak data. And I'm glad that I'm also able to learn uh, from, from, what you, uh, from what you've shared with us. I'll have Thank just one much. question. Yes. Just one question before I allow our participants, uh, if they have any questions, some can type in the Q&A Everyone can raise their hands. Uh, my question is, uh, are there any collaborations that you're having uh, with other institutions mm -hmm. uh, to improve or to add on the different uh, data that is in the, in the Wikipedia? OK, um, as a uh, librarian in training, I most of the time focus on um, creating awareness and improving the adoption of um, Wikimedia projects by GLAM professionals and their institution. So most times when we organize training, we reach out to stakeholders within the organization. So we reach out to various stakeholders across GLAM institution. So we reach out to uh, the libraries, we reach out to libraries, we reach out to museums, archives, and galleries. So as to see a way in which we can partner with them and um, make them know the essence of uh, why this data is very important, why they need to populate uh, their, their uh, data on Wikidata, because like we all know, it's a free repository of data. And uh, for most researchers that want to make use of uh, data, they most times find it very difficult to retrieve free data online. So if this uh, data is available on Wikidata, then it becomes a lot stress-free for researchers that wants to make use of this mm. data. So that's uh, like we collaborate with different stakeholders when it comes to any projects that we want to organize. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, there's another question which had come in. Okay. Uh, has there been any efforts to reach out to, to the continent-wide efforts like Africa that may also benefit from the leap sense? Have you got the question? Sorry, I didn't get that. I didn't get the question. Is there any effort to reach out uh, to the continent, to Africa, our efforts as Africans so that we benefit from, from this kind of project that you have? Oh, okay. Uh, I've I haven't really thought of reaching out to um, other African countries because uh, I have not really looked into um, 
a partnership or trying to create like a kind of collaboration with them. But I'm always welcome uh, for any kind of collaboration that would um, improve um, it, that will improve uh, the face of Liberianship, and it would also uh, enhance the way in which Liberians are uh, are changing, especially as we know that we're in the 21st century, where there are so many emerging technologies. And if different um, African countries can come together, collaborate, then it will make uh, the project a, a, a success and a big one at that. So I'm always open mm -hmm. for any collaboration. Okay, thanks very much um, uh, for your presentation. It was really great. And also for sharing your uh, successes as well. We hope that uh, you continue doing a great job and collaborate with other institutions and also other countries in, 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 on the continent and even uh, abroad. I don't know, uh, do, you have, do you have any questions for the participant? Any question? Okay. Since we are time bad, I would like to, to thank you and also to thank our participants uh, for taking part in this session. We look forward to having you in, in uh, participate in other sessions. Joe, thanks as thank well you. for coordinating. I wish you a, a good day. Thank you, everyone. Thank you very much. Take care. Take care.